The first thing to do is a selective choice of species, without knowing the exact number which are currently present here. It is the water cycle which guarantees us life on Earth. After a few months, the planted shrubs are blossoming and are already one meter tall. You can watch the lignification and the size and succulence of the leaves and their strength. You cannot see the weeds here due to the poor soil condition. Also, no other plants are visible besides the ones planted by us. The soil is degraded to such an extent that it doesn't have any microbial activity. This means that it's almost barren. We carried out a soil study and found that 98% of it is made up of sand and gravel. It's like having a sandy beach as a basis for a construction site. Because of the degraded soil, the predominant species here is the Acacia mangium, and only about 20% of the species are native. Here is where you can see the characteristics of the plantations. When there are more than five or six shrubs, we transplant, relocate, and use them to fill in the arid spaces. This is the full plantation cycle we follow. This main species will, by invading others, generate biomass and help the soil to recover.